This is Bulldog Breakdown on ABC 30, sponsored by Toyota. A new season of Fresno State football kicks off in a little more than two weeks, and this year the defense is expected to carry the team. In this week's Bulldog Breakdown, sports director Stephen Hicks shows us how a Valley native found his way home. Here we go. 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 Work continues at Fresno State's fall camp where the defense says its aim is to be among the best units in the nation. We are here to make a statement, prove that Fresno State is up there with those top schools and put us on the map even more than we already did. Maurice Norris is coming off his first season as a Bulldog, a Sanger grad who helped last year's team go from 1 and 4 to 10 and 4 and conference champs. We really didn't know a whole lot about Maurice. He was playing corner and doing some good things out there, but we were trying to figure out where his best spot would be. This year that's meant a move to the nickel position a hybrid of sorts between playing corner and linebacker. Requires him to do a lot of different jobs. It's a very versatile position. Being versatile is something Norris has learned to do both on and off the field. I didn't really have the easiest path to get here, but Fresno State opened me with welcome arms. The Sanger grad grew up playing basketball, but was recruited to play football by fellow Apaches Jalen Moreno Cropper and Aaron Mosby. I'm a great before crap, but crap's in the league now, so now I gotta play catch up. Mose has already been in there two years. After setting records at Sanger, Norris went to Orange Cove College where he tore his ACL and lived in a house with six other players. I really went through some trials there. A lot of dark moments where I just wanted to go home and like give it up type deal. From Orange County to Las Cruces, Norris was given a preferred walk-on spot at New Mexico State. But in June of 2021, the coaching staff changed their mind, leaving Norris with nowhere to play. I ain't never been a quitter. I kept my head up, you know. I look for the next opportunity to, to showcase my talents. That opportunity came from Corners coach J.D. Williams, who shared news of a prospect camp. Packing his things and driving 15 hours through the night, nearly 1,000 miles, Norris made the camp, made the squad, and is now looking to make his mark on his hometown team. Always in the back of my mind, I felt like this was the place where I was supposed to be, but I kept trying to run from it. A return home that allowed him to share this moment with his mom, Francina. I got to put on blue scholarship today. <laughs> It means everything to play here. My family come watch me. I'm at home with my moms every every day, every other day. You know, it feel good to to have my family members come out and support me the way they do. For Bulldog Breakdown, Stephen Hicks, ABC 30 Action News.